Welcome to Bosch's technical support on demand video series, BVMS 4.0 operator client and PTZ functionality. In this module, we're going to be covering how to utilize all the functionality of your PTZ while using BVMS 4.0 operator client. Our first step is to access video from a dome camera. After logging into BVMS op client, you'll notice that in my logical tree, I have two different types of camera icons. I have a fixed camera icon and a dome camera icon. To access live video, select a dome icon in your logical tree and drag it over to a viewing cameo on your right. Once live video appears, you'll notice that you have access to mouse over controls. The first of which are directional arrows. These directional arrows allow you to move the PTZ in any of eight directions. The further you move the mouse over control away from the center mass of the picture while left clicking your mouse, the faster the dome will operate. The next set of mouse over controls that you'll see is your PTZ zoom in and zoom out. By moving your mouse just below center mass of the picture, you will see a magnifying glass with a minus sign. If you move the mouse slightly higher towards the center mass of the picture, the minus sign will become a positive sign. While this mouse over control is visible, left click your mouse to operate the zoom in and zoom out functionality of your PTZ. By right clicking on your live video window, you'll have access to digital zoom menus. The first of which is zoom in. This is a digital zoom and not an optical zoom. Once you've activated the digital zoom in, you'll then have access to zoom out and zoom one to one. If you belong to a user group with the correct permissions and privileges, the right click menu will also give you access to the save preset position. When you select this, you'll receive a pop-up, set pre-position. At this point, you can set up to 99 presets for a Bosch PTZ. Different manufacturer's numbers may vary. When working with a PTZ and BVMS op client, just below the logical tree, there's a PTZ control area. In this area, you can use your mouse to control digital zoom in, digital zoom out, a virtual joystick for PTZ control, optical zoom out, optical zoom in, focus far, focus near, iris close, as well as iris open. This menu area also contains two drop downs, the first of which is prepositions. By selecting the drop down, you can choose any of the presets that you've already programmed into your camera. The next drop down is auxiliary commands. If your camera supports auxiliary commands, you can access these commands from this drop down. The last item we want to cover is PTZ speed. From the extras menu, select options. Once the options pop-up menu appears, you'll notice that you have a PTZ control speed slider. Depending on the speed at which you want your PTZ to operate, move the slider in the desired direction. Select OK. This should adjust your PTZ speed when using your mouse over controls. This concludes this tutorial. Thank you.